I thought your mother told you to take a bath. Actually, we can't take a bath anyway. The water heater is broken. Don't worry. Daddy will fix it. <coughs> what on earth? Hi, right, sweetie. I'm off to Moe's. Love you. <coughs> Whatever happened to your mail-order bride? Ah, uh, she got homesick for her old life, diving for tourist pennies in a Micronesian swamp. So her career got in the way. Yeah, I don't blame her. No girl wants to end up with a Joe Puke pair like me. Come on, we're going to the darkest bar in town. Relax. <sighs> uh, you look pretty clean. You uh, mind if I had this dance? It's all yours. Ha. <sighs> Uh, don't scream. Oh, hi. Want to join me for a Bacardi and soda? Uh, do you work for Bacardi? Ah, there's nobody for Mo. I'm just gonna die lonely and ugly and dead. Well, hello, Mary Sunshine. Huh? No, oh, cheer up. Here, have a flower. Guess you could have a lot of weird scars or a fake ass or something. You don't talk to a lot of women, do you? Well, no, no, well, not a lot. I... Well, your bow tie is just darling. Uh, ha, ha, well, thanks. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, look, I don't suppose you'd never want to, uh, I don't know, get together sometime. You mean like a date? Why, don't eat nothing for the next three days, because I'm taking you out for a steak the size of a toilet seat. <laughs> well, when you put it that way, my name's Renee. Yo, who cares? You're going out with me. So, Renee, it looks like you've taken quite a shine tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, it's like out of a storybook, ain't it? He's got this insecure, sweaty charm. Oh, yeah, I got that. And he's so thoughtful. Last night he bought all the seats in a movie theater just so we could have a romantic evening together. Uh, excuse me, sir, will there be anything else? Ah, uh, yeah. Park the dessert card under this beautiful lady's nose and charge it all to my Players Club card. <laughs> Players Club? Yes, sir. Maxed out? <sighs> well, that's it. It's all over. Renee ain't gonna want to hang around with no Joe Pinchpenny. Oh, come on, Mo. Think of all you have to offer besides money. Hmm. If you really need money, you could sell a kidney. Or maybe even your car. Nah, my car ain't worth nothing. But it is insured for five grand. Homer, I need your help. You gotta steal this car and wreck it for me. But I still don't know. I can just imagine what Marge would say. Homer, I insist you steal that car. I'll do it. Tomorrow night at 8, you go down to the waterfront and you steal my car. What about the cops? That's the beauty part. Every cop in town's going to be on the police department's moonlight charity cruise. You steal my car and park it on the railroad tracks. Then when a 1015 train comes along, wham! Insurance company pays off 5,000 clams. I keep showing Renee the sweet life. You're a genius, Mo. Why all the black? Why all the pearls? Why all the hair? Why anything? You look a little nervous, Dad. No, you look a little nervous, Lisa. You're up to something, aren't you? No! I'm just going out to commit certain deeds. Uh, excuse me there, officer. You see my car there? With the rubber hippie daisy? Space 7A? Uh, yeah, what about it? Yeah, I was just thinking what a good parking job I did with it. <laughs> I'm going to be the best car thief ever. Hey! No, you don't! Oh. They're showing hail to the chip! Oh, I have time to see one little movie. Mo, you seem awfully distracted tonight. <sighs> the train. You hear that? That's the train. Huh. Isn't that the most beautiful sound you ever heard? The train! Ah! No! I gotta find another way to wreck Moe's car. The plan went off without a hitch. What plan? The what? The, the one, wonderful evening plan. Hey, Mo, 
Isn't that your car up there with the rubber hippie daisy? Homer, you moron. Homer, you genius. <laughs> Geronimo! Huh? Well, that car thief can't hold his breath forever. You're under arrest, Simpson, for Grand Theft Auto. Gorgeous, gorgeous, right. baby. That's it, that's it. You know, fingerprints are just like snowflakes. They're both very pretty. Simpson, you have visitors. Listen, I know it looks bad, but all I can tell you is I destroyed that car for all the right reasons. I'd like to believe That's you. That's my girl. You just go home and don't worry your pretty blue head about it. Psst. Homer. Homer, wake up. Mo! Oh, Mo, thank God you're here. Tell the cops I didn't steal the car. Say you lent it to me. Yeah, I wish I could, Homer, but if I change my story, they're gonna throw me in here. Uh, all right, all right. I'll use the money to bail you out, Kate. There's just something I gotta do. Oh, look at that. Hawaii. Oh, that looks so romantic. Well, if Hawaii's what my baby wants, Hawaii's what my baby gets. Yana on and on a lula wa Hawaii. Hawaii? What about Hawaii? Mo? Who's going to Hawaii? Am I going to Hawaii? Stop saying Hawaii in there. Ukulele, pineapples, beach pistol, scandalously revealing thong. Going somewhere. What? <sighs> You are my friend, and you betrayed me. Oh, my God, he's right. Oh, how could I treat a friend that way? Exactly. Oh. Hey, get your mouth off of that. Would you care for some reading material? Hmm, this could be useful. Renee, there's something I gotta tell you. Oh, no. You're gay, aren't you? No, oh, boy, Renee, you sure can pick him. No, nah, it ain't that. What, so you're married? No, no. I, so, like a coward, I let Homer take the rap for the whole scam. And now the only way to clear him is to turn myself in. Unless... Yeah? Then we go to the graveyard and steal two corpses. Oh, my God. We, we, we switch clothes with them and leave them in the bar. Then we light a match. And woof! We start a new life in Hawaii. Goodbye, Mo. Ah, uh, she ain't coming back. Ah! 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 Uh-oh. You! Homer, thank God. You gotta help me here. Uh, I'll help you. Help you die! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Mo! Homer! Can you ever forgive me? Oh, I could never stay mad at you, Mo. After all, you get me drunk. Ah. Ah. My poor bar. Ever since I don't know when I've been drinking bourbon. Oh, another beer down here. Coming right up. Yeah.